to be away from Tommy for her own good. Corinna and Tommy smoke weed around my house, in the car, in the driveway, in the backyard. It really bothers me. So I have an 11 year old and a 13 year old, and I don't want them to be exposed to that behavior. My oldest son found one of Corinna's vape pens and put it in the drawer in his room. Corinna has also stolen money from my kids that they've had laying around in the rooms. It angers me of seeing this stuff. Dina kicked Corinna out. I was going to be the one to kick her out, and Dina beat me to it. I really don't want her back in my house. So you don't really know him? No. You just know what you see. And what I see in here. You know that she had issues before he ever came along. Yes. Except that <laughs> they elevated after he came along. It elevated more so because this the only person that I'm ever around. I hang out with him because I feel like at least I'm wanted. My company is wanted at home. It's always you guys in your room and the boys doing their own thing, and I'm the odd one out. So why am I gonna wanna stay and be at home when I don't even feel like I'm wanted there? You've been included when we go to dinner. You've been included in several family functions. We didn't have to, but we did, because we wanted you there. Just like you didn't have to leave me alone for a year, but you did that anyways. You're right. That does not dismiss the things that you've done. You're right. I know I've made mistakes, and I'll take accountability for that. I'm not, saying, I'm not saying I'm perfect, but at the same time, you think that just because you're here now, that for the time that you weren't here, that it's just, that, oh, well, I'm here now, so it doesn't matter. I, I was young, I, and I needed you, and Absolutely. you weren't there. You know what? With the exception of that little bit of time, and it does not excuse my behavior, it does not excuse me not being there. I 100% take ownership for that, but I have been there. And we had a good relationship. We did things together. In, in and your head. Really? I don't think so. You have some charges pending against you. Yes. For what? Stealing from my job. What was your theory, A, about getting away with that, and B, justifying that? I was under the impression that I'm going to be living in my car, and I didn't have insurance on it, it wasn't registered, so I felt like I was in survival mode, and I know it wasn't right, but I just felt like I was doing what I had to do at the time. You don't steal from people. You don't go to your job and steal $768. I know. And you stole money out of my bank account. I didn't steal it out of your bank account. Your card was linked to my Lyft and Uber account and Cash App, which you let me have on there before, so to say that I stole money out of your account I is don't kind have, of I don't have a Lyft or an Uber, as a matter of fact. You're right. The first, the first time is. I've ever been in a Lyft or an Uber has been out since we've been here. You're right. So I do. You used but my you card. used it before. You must have taken a picture of my card without my authorization, and you wrapped up all these charges. I didn't that? purposely go on there, put in her card information, and take money and go on, do Lyft rides and Where did you think it was coming from? My account. You don't have a bank account. Yes, I do. A bank account is an actual bank? It's, I have a debit card and I have where there's money being put in my account for direct deposit. So, so it is check that to make sure, like, oh, do I have enough money for this transaction? Like, I logged on to my bank account and that's why I noticed all this. Okay, y'all can do money management later. <laughs> my point is, you're making really bad decisions. And now you've got a charge against you, right? Yes. And did you have anything to do with this? Uh, Bond no. Other than that? Other than that, no, I didn't even know about it. But you had no idea about anything. The money that she kept at your house that I took her to go pick up to go get her car re-registered and back on the road, where did you think she came up with all these hundreds of dollars from? Well, she's telling me her grandmother is selling stuff. I'm give, I even give, I went through my clothes personally and found all clothes that I didn't wear anymore just so I can give them to her so she could sell because she was telling me she was selling stuff from her grandmother. You know what? You guys are talking like she's hanging out with the bad crowd. It sounds to me like he's hanging out with the bad crowd. <laughs> He's bailing her out of jail, and you're criticizing him for not knowing where she's getting money? Seriously? Well. No, come on. It would have been nice when I didn't know where Corinna was, and I was texting her for a few hours. You finally answered me after I asked if Corinna oh was okay. God. Well, she didn't want me to answer you. She, I, I was I, on, hold on, hold on. 
I was already already knew for a fact if she got arrested, it would have just made her situation even worse. And I wasn't about to put that stress on her, on her or on myself. Don't you think I would find out anyway? Well, I went to your house. You told me she was in the bathroom. Exactly. And where you said to, go get her. Were you going to go find her out of jail if I didn't go? My children. Like, no, my, you. She, my children have already been told. If you ever are stupid enough to get yourself exactly. arrested, exactly. That's do exactly not why they contact you because there was no point of contact. There's something where you can't get in touch with me. You literally just go straight to look my name up to see if I've been arrested. Like, that's really what that's, you think of me. That's because you have been doing nothing but criminal activities for a long time. You don't, you don't, drive, you don't drive around in your car and smoke weed all day every day. You can't even stand next to your car because the smell of weed coming out of it is so great. Coming up. Tommy says he's worried about Corinna because he knows she doesn't have a stable place to stay. I have some thoughts about that when we come back. Is there something?